Hello and welcome to Hare Krishna Tarot. Today our topic is what is the urgent message that you are supposed to hear right now. So this is a pick a card tarot reading and in front of you there are three pictures. Select whichever attracts you the most. You can select even more than one or you can select all of it if all the picture attracts you. So I have given the timestamps both in the description and also in the comment section. So you can go and click and you will be in your readings. So I will be seeing you in your readings. Whoever selected the first picture, that is the picture of Lord Ganesha in this read reading, what is your message for them? Okay. We have a bunch of cards coming. That is satisfied, silent, regulated and we have modest. So we'll try to know about what is this message about. Please give some confirmation divine. Yes, so I feel that this message can be about something where you are not feeling that happiness here okay so this message is about an area where you need to water okay where you need to provide all the nutrients or you have to supply something here okay you have to provide something in that area okay for this area to flourish this area to uh, brighten up this area you have to do something okay so this message is from that area of your life here where you have been repeating something and you are not getting the result it might be and you had to take uh, take some decision here okay in that area okay and there was something which has changed in this area okay and it is an area where it was not moving this area was not at all moving here okay and you were very tired okay in this area of your life here okay you wanted to receive that healing energy here okay and your guardian angel has been watching over you in and they have been seeing that you were uh, very worried about the situation here so your guardian angel will push you forward in this situation so you are feeling that why this is not moving i am giving so much okay but the message is coming from divine that you have to supply more okay you have to supply more because this area of your life okay, uh, is something which needs more from you, okay, which needs, the requirement is more here, okay. So that is the message coming that you want to feel satisfied, okay, but now you have to silently wait, okay, and you have to change something in your life because this, this area of your life requires more, okay. The demand is more here, okay. We, we know about demand and supply. Whenever there is this demand we have to supply so in your life here there is more demand okay from you and the supply is there okay it's there is a continuous supply but that supply needs to increase okay you have to intensify you have to increase the amount or you have to increase the might be number of working hours okay so you have to finish all the paperwork so you have to finish might be extra work you have to do or you have to work for extra hour something which you have to increase here in order to fulfill this task and your guardian angel will push you forward in this situation here okay so that guarantee your guardian angel is providing okay that you do the required energy you put okay so you have to just focus on your energy how much energy you are putting here, okay you need to increase that and the rest of the work your guardian angel will be doing here okay because we see that card of forward movement which came here so this is a guarantee coming from your guardian angel that they will push you forward okay like this butterfly pushing this girl here they will push you forward here you don't have to worry so we will try to see more divine please give some more confirmation we selected the first picture So the first message is coming is that goodness rising. So Ram's victory begins joy and envy. Ram and his brothers marry. So this is the story where Ram is going and uh, forward. And they are coming in this swimmer, Okay, That is where the marriage, where they have organized for the marriage of Devi Sita here okay and Lord Ram is coming and they are able to win over okay whatever was the term and condition that they have to break something here and they have to lift up something in order to win uh, this 
whatever uh, swimmer is organized here in order to win that they have to do something here so they had been do, uh, they had successfully completed whatever task was given here so, so that is this uh, card giving the guarantee that you will be able to do your task here okay but for that you have to have that strong will and strength and determination just like lord ram okay so this is something which everyone cannot do here this is something which requires that determination that patience that good qualities here okay and ultimately what happened lord ram was able to complete the task and ultimately we had that marriage happening so that is this card giving you the guarantee that if you work on yourself then you will surely get the result here and expertise card is also talking about the same energy that you have to increase your knowledge here okay that is this story is about hanuman crossing the ocean and entering the evil king ravana city he defeats all the opponents and finds sita okay so here this is also a success card this is also a marriage card and success card coming together here so you will be able to finally find what you have been looking for okay because lord hanuman was looking for devi sita and he was able to find here because of his talent of uh, because of his qualities here he was able to enter this kingdom of uh, this king of L ravana okay so you have to have that qualities of lord hanuman here okay you have to become expert okay in your field it's talking about your field your work area you have to become expert in that area only then you can be uh, you can find what you're looking for okay if you're looking for might be 50 percent increase in your sales then you can do that if you're looking for uh good response from your customers then you will get that response here only when you are able to provide what they are looking for okay and uh, that will happen only when you are trying to increase your knowledge and you're trying to learn and you're trying to become an expert here so this card is an amazing card coming for you that expect things to change okay destiny will favor you okay here there is no limit to what destiny can give you here okay so we will take some more cards divide for where we selected the first picture okay i think we got one card so this card is giving you the guarantee that there is something within you really you have to just activate here this is talking about the knowledge which you have to gather it's also there within you okay you might not have uh, remembered that knowledge but that knowledge is hidden within you it might be from previous lifetime you have the knowledge but when you try to learn and relearn in this lifetime you will be remembering that knowledge of yours which you have might be from your past okay might be from your childhood okay uh, that is time period when you have learned something and you might have forgot about because you might have learned uh, 20 years back or 15 years back you might have learned and you might have not remembered okay but now when you relearn that something you will be able to remember that here so this card is giving you the confirmation that learn this even if you have the knowledge previously okay if you even if you were an expert previously still relearn it relearning the same thing will help you to become successful here okay so this card is giving you the confirmation here ask from divine for some more messages divine please give some more messages we have the card that is creation coming so this creation card is talking about that you will be able to create because of the signs which you're getting from the universe here so suddenly you might see some kind of might be some program some might be movies or some kind of news or some kind of magazines which you're reading and suddenly you will get some ideas here about what you should do here so when you whatever you are doing in your day-to-day -day activities that will help you to come up with new ideas because science and synchronicities it's being provided to you from the universe here so universe is giving you the messages in the form of what you are seeing around you okay so that is a direct message coming indirect message can come in the form of dreams here okay so in universe is giving you always the signs what you have to do okay so this creative ideas will come when you just observe okay what is happening here and the next message is coming channel okay and so here you will be providing something that is for sure because we got the channel card here so you are providing something to the world here okay because of your creation because of your work you will be able to provide something here okay 
whatever work you're doing whether you, you are creating some kind of products here so your product that is the ultimate outcome okay that is possible because of your creative uh, thought process here okay because you are creatively able to redesign what product you had now you are presenting it okay to the customers might be by modifying it and creating new designs here okay so that is this channel card talking about doing that same work but might be presenting it with a extra masala with something new here okay the same product might be something you modify so that it looks fresh okay it's not looking boring it's something fresh and this will help you to get the result okay because you are not presenting something which is same like other people you're presenting something might be in a new package or you are presenting new designs or you are modifying it so here customers and whoever you are trying to satisfy they are not getting bored here okay even we get the we got the satisfied card here in the beginning so ultimate satisfaction will come okay when you are redoing your work by creatively thinking about what you should change here okay so we'll take for some more messages divine is for them divine what is the message for okay so pay time that is also coming as a message that you have to give more time to this activity of yours if you want to become successful don't get demotivated if the work is not done within few months because sometimes we also have to pay time it's not only about quantity and quality sometimes it's more about how much time we devote here make the right choice okay so that is an advice coming for you that whatever decision you are making that will lead to the result here okay and in that process you should let go of any ego coming in uh, ego that is sometimes we feel that this is mine and this is theirs and that is the ego here so just throw away that ego okay and be open to what the universe has to offer you okay when you let go of this ego and you make the right decision for your uh, self then new doors will open here in your life okay and you will see that god blessings will come here okay you are opening the door for blessing by letting go of that ego and by making that right decision for your own self here okay there is nothing selfish to think about your own self here you always have to do what is best for your own self here okay so that is also the message coming so we'll take some tarot messages for you then whoever selected the first picture in this reading two of cups okay so this two of cups card is talking about that you have to give yourself fully for what you want to get here because this will be reflected back here okay so what you gave you will get back so that is this two of cups talking uh, two of cups talking about because this two of cups is all about partnership so i feel that universe is coming as a partner here they are going to give you what you are providing here but here somehow what i feel universe wants you to provide more so that universe can give you more here so that's why universe has been asking you to increase the number of might be quantity might be the number of hours something you have to increase here okay even if you are already having the knowledge still you have to relearn here because universe is not happy with what universe is providing okay universe wants to provide more and if you are putting and increasing and multiplying what you are doing universe can open this gate here okay open this gate for this god blessings here and uh, you can see this card god and blessings come in unexpected way so universe wants to open this door for you okay so please type in the comment section that god blessings come to me in unexpected ways so if you like the video then please do subscribe comment like and share i will be seeing in the next video thank you for watching the video so whoever selected the second picture let us ask divine what is divine's message for you divine please help okay we already got the card so what is the card coming here so be tolerant okay and i feel that divine is giving the confirmation that go and proceed in this direction because you are surely going to get the result here don't get demotivated because divine is just testing your tolerance level here okay how strong you are okay how much strength you have so divine is just testing your strength here 
how much dedicated you are okay so divide is just seeing your patience level here okay so that is a test period that you're going through and divine is not unhappy with you divine is very happy with your work okay and divine is just testing okay how much more you can do okay so divine wants you to proceed okay and divine wants you to have that strength here okay so that you successfully come and prove that you are deserving okay and you are the person okay who can actually do what you have thought of doing so you have to prove something okay in front of this might be universe here you have to prove yourself here okay so i feel this is a very positive card coming that divine is happy with you and that's why the test period has come in your life and i feel that soon this test period is going to be over here and you will see the result of your belief okay because i feel that you have a very strong belief system you have a very strong uh, i feel that you have that strength and tolerance level and you are very strong here you accept things you believe you have that happiness in your life okay i feel that within you are very strong here because within yourself you are very strong okay that's why i feel that outside you can portray that okay and that's why divine is testing you that how much more you can do here okay divine is testing your strength here so because you have that belief system in your life you are also asked to have that submissive energy okay you are asked to uh, have that surrendered energy okay so here in the story of uh, this arjuna and lord shri krishna we see that arjuna having the belief that how can he fight with his own relatives here okay so that was his belief system that how can he because they are their loved ones here they are their teacher they are their friends and their family members so that was his belief system but what did the response he get he got from lord krishna here that is more than what you believe you have to believe in something which is divine here okay more than your own self there is this greater thing called that is divine here okay that is surrender energy here sometimes we have to do the task okay we have to fight because that is what is the correct thing to do at that time here because arjuna was fighting for that for his wife here okay so that was the cause here okay fighting for the woman who was tortured here okay so that was the story the fighting for the woman that was tortured here so he could not simply he could forgive the other person but it was something which is against karma here they had to the other party had to repay their karma here okay so that had this had to be done this was the duty of arjuna here so that message was given by lord krishna here okay that he had to even if he had that strong belief still he has to surrender himself to that divine energy here okay it is good to have that uh, uh, compassion compassionate energy for the other person but we also have to know what is right and what is wrong okay what happened because of that of the situation how many opportunities the other party had got to correct themselves here so sometimes we have to surrender to that greater cause here okay nothing is greater than this divine energy so we will take some other messages divine whoever selected the second picture what is the message for them divine please help okay so greater gain so greater gain that is possible only when we sacrifice here okay so that is the message coming that if you want to get something great you always have to sacrifice something okay then we have the next message coming that is alignment card aligned with goodness we cannot be defeated so when we are having those good qualities then nothing can defeat us okay that is when we are uh, following what is our duties okay we are going according to our dharma our duties we are following then nothing could defeat us here that what happened with arjuna okay arjun what happened with him he was following his duty and nothing could defeat him because he was going according to the instruction given by the lord here by the divine here okay what was right at that moment he had to do even 
if he had to suffer the pain he had suffered the pain okay by fighting for what was correct at the time okay so next card is coming that is hanuman card here so be devoted so that is a message coming devoted to that greater cause here okay and the next card is coming about lakshmana okay this card is talking about that partnership here okay something can happen when you find that perfect partner okay or that companion of yours okay that will help you to stay on that path here okay that will help you not divert to wrong direction so it's about your company okay the company you are trying to stay with okay so that is important then we have the next message that is a great venture unfolds with the inherit obstacle that must be faced so here sometimes we have to face one difficult situation because that difficult situation will let us to that gain here because we have the gain card coming here so sometimes we have to go to a road which is not traveled by other person here okay just like we see this lord hanuman traveling to lanka okay to find to search for mother sita here we see the ocean here in between and he has to travel by taking the other way here okay might be crossing the river crossing the ocean here so that is something which was not done by everyone here okay something you have to do which is not done by everyone here because you deserve this great victory here okay because we see lord ram getting the victory okay and wow how can this happen okay so we got benefit card also so you will get the benefit and the victory because of something which is unusual in your life okay you might have taken that extra route you might have taken something might be you are doing one work and you are doing some part time work okay also to support your family so you are doing something extra here i feel you're doing something which others are not doing here okay might be you are working while others are sleeping you are reading while others are simply watching television okay so something you are doing that is talking about this road less traveled okay others are not doing okay you are the one doing here what is that which you are doing just try to remember so that is the reason why you will get the victory and the benefits here okay and that's why you will get this great opportunity and the fortune here okay and there will be this birth birth of something great okay that is auspicious something great will come in your life here because of this action here okay and we have mother sita coming here okay that is the that is giving us the confirmation that no matter what be focused on your goal okay don't be uh, diverted so we'll try to take some more cards here divine whoever select selected the second picture in this reading so your message is that you have to stay focused there might be lot of noise coming there might be a environment where you cannot concentrate but still you have to somehow carry that burden and also lift that burden from your head here okay because focus is very important here so your message which is coming from divine is that you need to increase your focus level here so we need to forgive ourselves and even we need to forgive everyone in our surrounding here okay and we need to proceed ahead okay so that is this card talking about so we'll take some more messages divine whoever selected the second picture in your search for whoever selected the second picture so your message which is coming is that you need to take care of your own self here you need to increase your concentration level and that can happen when you are healthy and you are taking care of your own self here okay then you will see that growth will happen when you take care of your own self then growth will happen when you work on your own self then growth will happen here so it is also advised that you surround yourself with positive people and in case if you have that environment where uh, people are not supporting you then still you have to somehow control your mind and focus here okay divine please help whoever whoever selected the second picture divine what is the message surrender so your message is that you need to surrender and 
let go of false ego this card is repeating in all the piles so something related to the belief system that this is mine and this is theirs so that is sometimes uh, forming that ego here okay so ego can be removed only when we feel that everything belongs to the universe and we don't have anything of our own here okay even our children they are not our children first because we are in a journey here so no one belongs to us here okay even if we have the love for them we should not be attached so that will help us to come out of that ego that this is my property or this is my land so sometimes we all go through that process here okay so that is this card talking about so we will take some more messages divide chair what is your message for them okay abundance is coming i was talking about this abundance previously that you will get the abundance you will get the great gain okay because you have taken that way or we you have selected that uh, action which was not done by other people because it was difficult so that's why you are getting that gain and that is this abundance card talking about that you will receive that abundance that fortune in your life okay that is mother lakshmi is coming here in this reading okay and giving you the confirmation that whatever you're working for in future you will be earning because of that work of yours okay so earning is there here yeah, okay that profit is coming okay whatever you have started you will receive the profit if you're investing you will receive the reward here okay so reward is coming that's for sure so take a moment to reflect and meditate where you have invested here because surely you will get the benefit in the coming future divine please give some more confirmation divine what is the message for them please give some confirmation eight of swords and ten of wands so this eight of swords card is talking about you having the doubt that how can i have that much power how can i be the heroine how can i be a person who has so much of power to get that gain or that abundance here so you have that self doubt here so this eight of swords card is talking about you doubting your capability to get the abundance or to be your life stories heroine here okay to be that victorious person okay so there is some doubt here okay there is surely there here this card is talking about you have to do something to come out of that energy of doubting your own self okay because that is something which is hindering your growth here okay so pile number 2 please type door of abundance naturally open to me in the comment section if you like the video then please do subscribe comment like and share i will be seeing the next video thank you for watching the video whoever selected the third picture let us ask divine what is divine's message for the third picture in this reading so bright before taking this card i feel that here whoever selected the third picture something exciting is coming in your life here okay something which will not let you sit here okay so let's see what's the card so satisfied card this is repeating from the previous pile i think we got this card in pile number 1 i'm not sure but we surely got this uh, card in one of the reading here okay so that is here so i feel that something exciting is coming in your life okay and that will help help you get that satisfaction here okay something exciting which will happen because of your action which you take sudden action okay which you take and that will help you to grab the opportunity okay and that will help you get free from all the chain which is right now hindering your growth here okay so i feel that in the coming future you are going to be a person who is going to be considered very knowledgeable by other people they might come for advice from you okay so let's see divine whoever selected the third picture picture in this reading victory is coming for you pile number 3 okay you have amazing card coming first card is satisfied card and the second card is victory so whatever you are doing you will surely feel that satisfaction and victory coming here okay but there is also a message coming that you have to be careful because something uh, related to conflict is also coming here that in this victory okay whatever victory you are achieving you also have to fight okay something you have to fight here and then you will get the victory so there can be some of uh, conflict which you have to go through in order to achieve this victory here okay some truth has to be revealed or some fight has to take place here in order to get this victory okay so this victory is not that easy here okay 
So you have to find out what promise you made to your own self and that promise you have to fulfill here in order to achieve this victory here. What promise did you make? Okay, in the past here and that you have to reflect, go and reflect, okay, and you have to fulfill your promises here, okay. So divine, please help where the selected, okay, I think we are getting the cards. What's the card? Okay, we will not take this many cards, but what is this card? I am the magic in your heart. I think we got this card in the previous pile, that is, divine is giving you the confirmation that you have the truth the promise which you made okay that is there within your heart here there is something which you promised in the past and that you have to fulfill now here okay because that is something which will lift that burden from your head here okay if you fulfill that promise that burden will be lifted from your head here okay divine please help whoever selected third picture what is your message for that divine what is your message for them whoever selected that is you should take time to be grateful to the universe and to the people around you. You are too busy doing your tasks that you are not having time to even think about what you are doing here. Okay, So take a break, okay, might be, and take time to thank the universe and the people around you. Okay, So take rest if it's required. Okay. Because you are preparing for this battle, you are pre because you are preparing to come out from a conflict here and that's why you need to take time to think about uh, the people who had helped you in this journey here. Okay, And the next message is, this is talking about you uh, getting the guidance here from the people here. Those who helped you in the past, they can also help you in the present time period here. So go and take time and reflect to the situation and think about the people who had helped you in the past. People, that same community, that same group of uh, people or association can help you at the present moment here. Okay, so you can seek their guidance from uh, guidance from them here. You can learn from them here. Okay, and then you can easily get the victory here. Okay, so we'll take more messages. Divine, please help. And what is your message for whoever selected the third picture? Okay. So we have a bunch of cards. Let's see what's the card. Intuition. Okay. So your intuition can guide you and help you know about who are the people who had helped you in the past. And they will also help you in the future. Okay. So you need to trust your intuition. So there is no limitation to what you can achieve if you take help of those people. Okay. Who had helped you in the past. So you need to observe and find out. Who are those group of people who had helped you in the previous time period here and that will help you to advance in your life here in the coming future okay so we'll take more messages divine please help whoever selected the third picture in this reading we have this false ego card coming in all the piles so there is a common message for all the group that you need to yes surrender card was also there in one of the pile so this is a common message for all the groups here that let go of that energy of I and you and uh, they and me. So that is the energy which is uh, dividing us. Okay, That is the energy of ownership that this is mine and this is yours and this is my family and this is my children. So, so there should be that uh, awareness that no one belongs to us Some, nothing is our property here okay in this world here so that is this a false ego card talking about that letting go of that me energy mine energy okay we all go through that process here so surrender that everything is coming from this divine here and that belongs to divine nothing is ours here so that is this card talking about so if you surrender and if you let go of that ego that comes in this journey in this lifetime then you will see see that the help is coming okay from unexpected ways here okay so we'll take some tarot messages divine please give some message for whoever selected the third picture in this reading so i feel that when you surrender something will come in your life okay that will surely come that advancement and victory will surely come but for that you have to resolve that inner conflict or you have to resolve that outer conflict here okay or you have to fulfill that promise which you had made to your own self here so here this is the time to go inward and find out 
what promise you made to yourself because that promise okay, which you made to your own self you are the one who can fulfill and that will lead to new opportunities coming in your way here okay because this knight of swords card is talking about being very ambitious and cleverly planning out things here and this is also talking about being very success oriented and having the authority here okay so you can be like this knight of swords having that knowledge and having that authority and being success oriented and ambitious only when you know what you had promised okay what you wanted to do okay and that will also help you to resolve that inner conflict and outer conflict in your life here so please type in the comment section i surrender totally to the divine will if you like the video then please do subscribe comment like and share i will be seeing you in the next video thank you for watching the video